Memphis is a rough place and a lot of BS go on and go around out here. But yeah. it seems to breed like some dope artists. Like even from back in the day, blues was started. Yeah, so right, right. Even to to this day right now. I had the hey, B V King. Yes, you know what sir. A lot of motherfuckers came from her. Yeah, I uh, you know, I hear that bullshit they say that we got a curse on our city and anybody see it, they bullshit as hell. I don't give a fuck who they is, uh but uh ain't no curse on the city and the curses on the city is we all uh, breathe music motherfuckers, you get what I'm saying? People who can play a good guitar, people who can write a good song, uh, come up with a good beat, they, we bred them from here. You it's know a give and a take. You can't expect the genius to come from that with just right. straight lovey-dovey situations. Right. They're going to come with some thorns with the rose, you know? Yeah, yeah, like a motherfucker, you got to. You know, a rose is a pretty thing, but uh, you grab the wrong fucking way, then what? Right, <laughs> you that's know right. They got some defense on my ass, you yes, know what I'm saying? Yes, sir. Yeah, but, you know, hey, man, it is what it is. We just got to, uh, I, think, I think niggas just got to learn how to keep it real. And, and, you know, I always do interviews and y'all always ask me, what do I got, what can I say to uh, the younger guys is uh, right now, at this moment right now, I would say learn how to be loyal, you know what I'm saying? Learn how to stand for something, you get what I'm saying? Yes, sir. Uh, you, you, the shit that we might be standing for is not what you really supposed to be standing for, you know, they say, uh, all people have a purpose for being on this earth. What's your purpose? You know, you find out that, and then you stand on that. You know what I'm saying? And you know, for for the ones who smart enough to do that, or pay much to, uh, pay that much attention to yourself, then you automatic uh, will learn that. You know. See I, that that's easy said. Uh, you from here? I'm from Chicago, so I really don't know the politics of Memphis. So you can easily say, okay, you can do this, you can do that. But you know more than I do as far as the climate in Memphis. You see all the things that's going on, a lot of people going to jail, a lot of people getting killed, stuff like that. Yeah, but that's a group of that's a group of niggas that really ain't been paying, you know what I'm saying, attention. And just so happens for them type of niggas that uh, ain't been paying a lot of attention. And, well, you know, sometimes we are getting into this music game. And we get to being around other people that like this music game, that like us when we in it, or we let that shit go to our head. See you know what I'm saying? And we get to doing shit that we don't supposed to be doing. Or uh, we don't say it once in once a uh, point of time in our life that I wouldn't get caught doing this. You know what I'm saying? And and uh niggas are. But you know, like I say, I always say that's that's that got something to do with party of the internet. Yeah, when the internet, the internet came, yeah, yeah, yeah. When the internet came, then niggas start, you know, bitches been asking niggas to show their feelings for a long time. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> and you get what I'm saying? Yeah, but, right. you know, now all of a sudden niggas is acting like bitches on the internet. You get what I'm saying? They snitching. <laughs> they wearing these type of clothes that they were, you know what I'm saying? You know.